73. Um, I was uh, sitting here today uh, doing nothing because it's my day off and I don't have to uh, be anywhere until 4 today so I'm babysitting my granddaughter Scarlett. You guys have all seen her in earlier episodes. But I thought I would do um, sort of a short altar tour. Um, I, me and my boyfriend just moved into this apartment. And let's see, we are almost right on top of the road, and this is a main road, so all of the energy, all of the uh, negative energy and positive energy, all the energy comes flowing through this window right into my apartment. And if you look, all the way down there is my bedroom, the bathroom, my son's room, and the kitchen, so all of the energy gets flows straight that way and it kind of pools in here and there's nowhere for it to go because you know my son doesn't like his door left open um and there's there's no exit so i've put my stuff up in my windows i put my i don't know if you can see it up there my wind chime my snail wind chime up there. I've got my plant babies in all my windows uh, to kind of absorb the energy that's over there in that window. And uh, yeah, so you know, as much as I hate doing it to my my plants, this one here, this guy here, seems to love the energy because he has just exploded since we've moved here. I have had to take cuttings from him, what, I think three times now, because he's just gotten out of control. I put him in a bigger pot when I was at my son's place, and I did, um, that, that was back in February, and he wasn't half as big as he is now, and he just, he just spread out like crazy. But, um, anyways, I did a small altar tour, and, um, we're still unpacking because I work five days a week, and then... I usually get two days off. This week I only got one. So once I, uh, and, and those days I usually spend with my grandkids, um, <clears throat> watching my, my daughter's daughter because she's working two jobs. And my son and uh, his girlfriend have the two, have two kids and I try to spend as much time with them as I can. But it doesn't leave me much me time. So sure as hell doesn't leave me any time to do anything with my apartment. I mean, I just realized today's the 28th of June, and last time I looked at the calendar, it was May, so I've lost almost an entire month. Anyway, um, if you've watched any of my other videos, you'll know that I, I, I tend to make my entire living space sacred space, so that means altars just about everywhere. I have altars all over my house, usually. I haven't set up all of my altars yet um, as you'll see like I've got my main altar semi set up it's still got some work that I'm doing to it um, I've got to find places for things we had to get rid of a bunch of stuff when we moved because we moved from a, an apartment to my son's place so we had nowhere to store anything so we had to get rid of some of the older stuff some of my, my bookshelves my stands they, they went the way of the dodo and um, you know, like I've kept what's most important to me, so, you know, but I, I'm i still working on it. And the place is a mess because I have to do cleaning this afternoon. Um, it's 6 a.m. and uh, I didn't want to start cleaning or doing anything like that yet because I have somebody living underneath me and somebody above me and the, the people upstairs have two little kids and the lady downstairs and an older lady and I didn't want to start making noise this early in the morning so so as you can see from the video my place is still a little bit rote but hopefully you know you get the gist of what I'm trying to do here and uh, when I'm done when I finally get time to do stuff I'll, I'll do an update video and show you my progress show you my other altars as I get them set up so Enjoy the video, and uh, I hope you come back and see me again. Okay, so this is my living room altar. This is my main altar here. And I have 
all of my witchy stuff on here. I've got some some sage. This is my little candle holder that I use for for burning my sage. I got my diffuser, some corn dollies. There's my god and goddess statue. And uh, then it kind of, uh, and all of my little implements and others of the coconut shells that I made into altar bowls. And my crystal water, my moon water. Um, and then I, I kind of incorporated my windowsill because that's where all my plant babies are. And and then, then there's the family altar that I'm still setting up. This has uh, got my plants on it, my Smurfette that my daughter got me, my boyfriend's family, him, his dad, and his brother. And, uh, yeah, so that's my main altar. My, um, I'm going to do a more in-depth video later, but uh, th these are my main two altars, the kitchen and this one here. But then there's... Uh, that one there that needs to be set up, my boyfriend put a stereo on it, but that's coming down. And then there's my um, my other one with my angels and my stuff that my kids have gotten me. So I started putting that one up, and at the bottom is my little cat bed. My cat likes to sleep on that bottom piece. So, And I have the grandkids here, so I don't really put anything on those bottom pieces because... You know, little fingers and glass, they just don't go good together. And I've had some of these for so many years. That circle of angels there my daughter got me from a yard sale like five, six years ago. These um, my kids got me for my 30th birthday. Um, I'll be 43 August 8th, so yeah, I've had them that long. But so far, that's what I've got set up. And like, as you can see, I don't have, I have like one picture on my wall there, and one there, and my two little metal guys that my cousin Brittany gave me. And then there's, there's my hallway, goes all the way down to my, my room, my son's room, the bathroom, the kitchen, and the closet. And that's it for now. Um, once I get everything set up, I'll, like as you can see under the desk there, I've still got some stuff that's uh, in bags and boxes. So I'm working on it slowly, but like I said, it, with work and uh, taking care of the grandkids, I just I haven't had the time to get my house situated. And we've been here almost two months, but I will get there. And uh, when I do, I'll do an update video and show you guys uh, my altars. As you can see, I've got all my green stuff in just about every corner of this room. This little guy. Oh my god, it's getting so big. I've taken cuttings off for him. And when I got him, he was like three sticks in the dirt. They were going to throw him out at Walmart. And I, I got him for $2 because they it was he was dying. And look at him now. Put him in a big pot, and he went nuts. He, I've taken clippings from him twice now, and uh, replanted him two or three times. So and that's huge now. He's spreading out across my window. But as I said, I will bring another video. And it's almost the end of June, so Canada Day is coming, and uh, I'll take some video down at the lake this year and. my view out my front window but blessed be everybody and I will do another tour another time and I will uh, show you my revised versions of my altars blessed be